I'm Sula Kola here with Mike Geekus, a senior electronics editor and one of our resident phone experts. He is going to tell us about some exciting innovations and announcements expected at this year's Consumer Electronics Show. All right, so Mike, what are you excited about? You know, we may get some big news from Verizon. There's been a lot of talk about the iPhone, one of the coolest phones out there, and we're inclined to agree, moving over there. And this time, it looks like the stars may be aligned. We already have seen the iPad, again, very pop, one of the most popular tablets out there, making its way to Verizon. It's being sold there. And it doesn't seem like it's going to take much to nudge the iPhone there. All right. Now, what about 4G networks? They're a lot faster than the regular data networks. And they allow phones to perform much better. For example, see smoother videos. And, and in many cases, give them new, gives them new features, such as video chats. Hey, Mike. What's going on? I'm just getting ready for CES. In other words, you can have a face-to-face -face conversation with a friend just by picking up the phone. Now, would I pay more for that? If I, if I call someone, do I pay the same amount as if I'm video chatting with them? Some services charge you more. Others remains to be seen. For example, Verizon just rolled out their 4G service, but they don't have a phone yet. We have to see what the plans look like when there's product out there. 4G is great and all, but there are only a handful of 4G phones out there now. Hopefully, we'll see more at the show. All right, so what other new technology are you excited about? Well, there's a new technology that's not exactly new. You may have heard of it or have seen it in action. Uh, you've seen Easy Pass when you go through a toll booth mm -hmm. and without stopping and sometimes paying for gas by waving uh, a keychain. That's called near field communication, and it may be making its way into phones in a big, big way. So imagine you're at a register and you've you've uh, you want to pay for an item. Instead of reaching in for your wallet, just pull out your phone and wave it in front. So now, is this something that's already out? It actually is. The Samsung Nexus S, it's available, and it has that technology built in. What remains to be seen is what kind of applications they develop for it and what kind of security measures they take out. But uh, it looks like a promising technology, and we may see more phones with it uh, in 2011. All right, thanks, Mike. For more information on cell phones and smartphones, check out our ratings.